So, hello guys. Tonight I'm going to present to you a final match uh, I made in Arena with uh, an insane summon against uh, some priest. As you can see, the deck features many strong early game cards, particularly a swirl combo between two Bloodstained Raiders and our three weapons, two axes and uh, a power miss. Only weakness uh, in the deck is uh, the complete lack of fall drops. So let's see how this went down. It soon was a hell of a match. Thrall versus Anduin. <laughs> Life shall bring victory for Doomhammer. So normally here I would uh, keep the Unbound Elemental, but uh, as I said, uh, the deck was so strong at its early game, I decided to risk uh, a better start. Opponent kept just two cards, and we were rather punished to give uh, the Elemental back for Mulligan. At least our opponent didn't coin uh, a good drop. Here he brought a uh, work in the game and uh, we got some value out of our fire mess for a clear kill I tried to keep the dream of a mech alive here and uh, didn't uh, slay the golem might find the target for uh, the weapon next turn anyway but I think uh, the Resurfer might have been a better uh, drop since he seemed to challenge uh, the golem itself. Here I made uh, the most questionable play yet, since uh, I figured uh, he was, uh, he, it would be hard for him to get around the creeper as well. Priests uh, don't have uh, that many ways to deal damage to complete their kills. Maybe their biggest weakness. But I pushed him for uh, Nova. Which was a bad scenario, but uh, since he had it anyway, we might as well uh, take it out uh, this moment and not later when we have uh, a horde of minions uh, on our side of the board. Finally, we get the board. But our opponent uh, still has uh, some races up his sleeve. Global came really handy here. Always uh, great to see a dance of removals on those late games where uh, everyone's deck is so strong. Luckily for us, uh, he didn't uh, find uh, his orphan like that. We must cleanse the sun well. And that was uh, another uh, tough call. I knew I would find a better target for my hex uh, later on, and I only played one of them. But still, uh, leaving the Wargame was out of the question as uh, it would uh, trade uh, two minions for one, or maybe uh, more. Damn, stand ready. And uh, trading it myself uh, would uh, net me minus two minions. Pro tip if you go and trade, do so first with your loot folder, you will be surprised with uh, your tablets. Might change your whole term. So that was a good topic indeed, as it uh, gave us room to abuse our uh, Inspire mechanic even more. 
Get another removal from our phone. But at least uh, our uh, Valiant survives. Let us see if it is. So here we get uh, another shoot object. Allowing this to buff the elemental and uh, set up for a buffed uh, blood cell raider. No need to rush with the raiders here, even if we're gonna clear the board. And here goes a slight misplay of me, as uh, I suffered an extra damage to my Valiant for no reason. As I would, would, would uh, just kill uh, the Sinkmeister with him. And here I shift my right to punishment. And the game went on. At top that mode from this point the uh, Well played. We had the bad luck to be at exactly 15 life here for the buff dragon crusher. Even with uh, the three spawns from the runs, uh, trading here was out of the question, as uh, we would uh, lose too many minions to clear the big guy. So I figured I'd uh, risk it and go face. <coughs> Besides against using the second size of my axe, for my two, unless. And uh, here came the big guys. Our opponent somehow found uh, 27 points of stats in his 10 mana. At top. So we stick to the plan as we got the taunt for now. We trade what is absolutely necessary not to be overrun and keep going face, keeping the smoke green blue. As the board is now, we are set up for lethal unless our opponent double kills uh, the minions with his. Another big drop comes. And he wisely heals his face. And just when things started looking really grim, we told the elemental. Can't really give uh, anything. Uh, I mean, that was uh, the plan to attack face, and uh, he cannot uh, defeat us unless he tops us up. So I decided to take that risk. The 
game was set up for little and this he finds something. And he does. In the light's name. I was just getting ready to tell him well played for the game. Maybe I could have strayed in the Draconis, but I don't think uh, it was worth it. So now the only way we stay alive since we have no lethal anymore is to clear two of his guys. Uh, and uh, at least uh, we can trigger our death battle to keep three extra minions for next turn on our ball. So we take out uh, the five life crusher. Actually took me some time exploring my options here. Opponent uh, was half pressed as well and uh, robbed his turn. And here he chose to set up for little himself and found a third crusher. But with object, our two remaining damage for little and uh, got the game clear. It sure was uh, an extremely unconventional <laughs> and uh, fun uh, game to play with many changes at pace. So, here are my rewards from the wins. And till the next time, see ya!